What's up? I'm so fired up right now because I've been waiting for this knife here. This is the TRC Speed Demon. And uh, I'm so lucky I got this thing pretty quick. From DLT Trading. Um, these knives are made in Lithuania. Freaking awesome. So pumped. Was watching the tracking on this knife every day, waiting for it to come in. And uh, sure enough, it was just like days this thing was sold out. So, um, and I wanted, you know, before I got it, I wanted to just kind of see it. Uh, I don't know, learn more about it. So I was like, going on uh, YouTube and checking out some videos and I could not get a video in English on this knife. So um, like, you know what? I'm gonna make my own review on this one. Um, so here it is, guys. And, um, I'm just gonna show you the Speed Demon, and this is a special edition they did. This lava black in the mic micarta um, insert in these handles. Now I don't know if you if you've been on TRC's website, which is pretty cool. They got a, they got an awesome website, but um, you know they they depict this knife, and, and you get it, and it's like raw form. So that's 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 how they display it, and this is that's Elmex steel. It's a super steel, super strong. Um, but notice how it, inside the handle they don't have anything anything um, in there. It's just kind of like a blank, you know. But still, I just, I don't know, something about this attracted me. I was looking for an everyday carry knife. And um, to, to see this is just, I don't know, just something about it that I loved. So this is, uh, these are the specs on it, okay. Helmax steel satin finish, the blade length 8 millimeters. Uh, overall length that was a concern of mine because i got big hands so i wanted to make sure that i could hold this knife and it would be comfortable in my hands um blade thickness awesome um and the sheath is awesome too the kydex and and it's very lightweight okay so i'm thinking this is what i'm buying and then i'm like wait a minute and i was so pumped when i saw it on tlc's website um that they actually had it in stock but look at the price i was like dude 440 bucks like why but this is after i placed my order so it was awesome i called talked to talk to this guy paul which i don't know if you ever called dlt trading but uh great customer support you actually talk to somebody over there and uh and he's like yeah it's special edition knife and i'm like well why is it so expensive and then he drew attention to the fact that this one is vanitas vanitas i don't know how you say it, vanitas 4e so this is a different type of steel, okay? This steel is like, again, super steel, bigger, stronger than the LMAX. I don't know too much about steel, so, you know, don't quote me on everything, but I know that this is a step up. And so the price, I'm like trying to make sense of it. So that's why it's so expensive. One, we've got a black coating, but we're talking the entire knife, full tang, being made of this steel so you can talk you can just think and imagine the strength of this blade okay of this knife um i could probably you know hammer this into a piece of wood and stand on this handle without it bending and breaking um which is awesome Cut, love the detail if you're not familiar with trc um found these knives um my brother told me about them they are perfect Perfect. I mean, even see that 4E, look at how it says V4E right here. I mean, it's not even like faded. You can you can read it perfect. Speed, theme. look at the, the, the text on the knife. These are flawless. They are made in Lithuania and handmade. And if you don't believe me, go on YouTube, put in TRC knives and watch these guys legit in their factory honing, cutting, sharpening, building these blades. They are awesome. Um, honestly, if I was, I can't imagine like, you know, buying another blade that's, that's not from them. Um, but what's so cool about these knives is they, they just have a, a, a culture, they have a vibe. I mean, look at the box, this is the box. Tears seam, Blades of Honor, Tales of Men. And it's awesome because they've got like this, you know, they believe that every knife has a story. And what story is your blade gonna tell over time? 
you know, where is it going to go? What is it going to do? Um, this knife, I'm telling you, this, this is going to go with me every day. And this is not going to be in the drawer. This is not going to be on a shelf. This is going to be used. <laughs> we'll be cutting peaches and, and, and plants and digging and sharpening and doing whatever comes our way with this. Okay? Um, no complaints. Absolutely no complaints. I'm hoping, uh, you know, you can, you can see in this video um, pretty well kind of the, the detail. When I say flawless, I mean flawless. I mean, I don't see anything out of place on these blades. Okay, I have with it, it's, uh, it's Big Brother here. Yeah, I mean, it doesn't even compare, but you know, this is the apocalypse with the apocalyptic finish. Um, putting this beside, <laughs> the, beside the speed, I mean, it's just cool. I mean, they belong, you know, when they're on the table, they belong together. Um, let me see, I, I don't know what else to tell you about this. Uh, the sheath is pretty cool, okay? So if you're wondering why it's got this long, why it has a long rope, is uh, you can wear it around your neck, okay? Um, I love the way they designed it so it can go on my belt also. So, so you see this strap here. Um, and I have no problem wearing this to the office. I mean, talk about classy. I mean, you know, button down shirt. It's a gentleman's knife. Everyday carry, blade's not too long. Just to give you an idea, I mean, I got big hands, so, you know, long, thin, but I'm gonna just give you an idea of, uh, overall length because this was a concern for me i'm like am i getting a t is this knife going to be too small look at that all right so your blade is about three little little just about three inches a little more okay but fits well in your hand i mean these are some other other knives that i've got around um again they can't compare this is the sog xr you know very heavy duty you know this is a seal knife i don't know if you're familiar with them um, but, but pretty, pretty cool. Got this for the durability, you know, just to do some rough outdoor work, but there's no reason this speed demon cannot do what that does. Okay. Here's a bench made, pretty awesome knife. Didn't like it when I first got it cause it's so damn light, but, um, everyday carry. Again, I mean, you can wear this thing in the swimming pool with a bathing suit. It's so light. Um, we got another bench made here. Love the grip on that handle, obviously, but I mean, put these together side by side. I've been carrying this every day. Um, pretty cool. I mean, Bark River. It's a classic everyday carry, beautiful knife, Damascus steel, but put that next to the speed demon. So obviously, like, why did I get, you know, it's just different. It's come so different. You know, nice little classy Microtech knife, small. You know, not gonna do a lot of hard work, but I uh, very excited about this, and uh, I have, you won't go wrong. So check out DLT Trading, guys, and uh, you know, sorry it's sold out. So pumped I got one, and um, but check it out. I mean, I know they make different. They have uh, different. They come out with different styles and whatnot. So, um, all right. Thank you so much. This is Marco from Real Reviews.